Hello everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel Learn Just Be with Mahesh. Today we're going to see an interesting concept. The concept is how do you find the external IP address of a virtual machine? Now, if I just stop it here, you'll say Mahesh, hold on, we know the answer. No need of a video. So usually what we'll say, just go to the GCP web console and you should be able to see the external IP address if it's provision. But the catch here is not via web console, but via command line interface. So if you were to figure it out, a uh, the external IP address of the machine using command line interface. How do we do it is the the whole video which we wanted to share today. So uh, for this video, the base is going to be uh, the metadata server where we have also spent some good amount of time on this metadata server in one of the couple of videos back. Uh, I guess three or four videos back we had seen. So where I had explained uh, the toughest interview GCP interview question which I had got and I had tried to leverage metadata server to to its fullest potential to get an answer for that. So we are going to use the same thing in this video also. So let's get started. So this is the command which has been shared by the customer to log in to the virtual machine, which is having a internal IP address and an external IP address, but they have not shared the external IP address with me. So I'm just going to use G Cloud Compute SSH option and the most important thing is I'm going to use tunnel through IPA. So using which I should be able to log in with the internal IP address. Uh, there are a couple of videos which I've also made on cloud IPA. Uh, so you should be able to look into the thing and I'll also put it in the uh, the cart or the pop up screen which comes in the video. So let me hit enter and see whether I'm able to connect to this virtual machine for which I want to find the external IP address. So let's wait for the uh, putty window to pop up. Once it pops up, usually the font would be slightly smaller. So what we'll do is uh, we'll get the font size increase so that you will have a better visibility. So if I click on the change, so 18 should be a good one. So done. Now, as usual, clear the screen, uh, get the complete real estate by typing this. All good. So now, uh, if it's a virtual machine, usually we will type something like IP space A. When we do this in GCP, you'll get only the internal IP address, the one which you see here, 10.1148.0.11 is the internal IP address, RFC 1918 standard. So it never shows you a external IP address. And to know that external IP address, the best option is to use a command something like this, which is, is again based on the metadata server, which we had explored in the couple of videos back, the toughest interview question video. So if I hit enter, it's going to give me a wonderful set of information. And one of the information which it gives is the external IP address. It also gives me the internal IP address if you want to verify it. So the output of IP space A is also shown here. Cool one, right? So this is the key part which I wanted to show. Now, if I just stop it here, you may think may, may not be this may not be the actual internal external IP address. To verify that, I have the access to the console. Let me just swap it to the console and let's verify it. And let me bring back my putty window. And if I just clear the screen and run the command, look at it. So it is 34.87.13.250 and the internal IP address is 10.148.0.11. So this is how you should be able to quickly find out the external IP address. And uh, if you have seen any uh, official materials and all right, usually the slide will say virtual machines in GCP can is aware of only its internal IP address. It cannot figure out or it cannot show but it's not even aware of its external IP address. If you were to get the details, you can use metadata server. So this is one of the options which I have figured out. If you have any other options of finding out the external IP address, please let me know in the comment section. Uh, happy to learn from that. So, so that's a video which I wanted to share today, folks. Uh, how do we find the external IP address of a virtual machine using command line, uh, via command line with the help of metadata server? Hope the video is uh, helpful. Thank you for watching.